We love life. We love this apartment. We love our job. We love our friends and family. We love everything about home. But being stuck at home sucks. Because for us, it's all about planning that next trip, that next adventure. It's about leaving the mundane behind and chasing the excitement of not knowing what tomorrow will bring. Europe, Asia, America, a tiny paradise in the middle of an endless ocean. Travel is what we live for. First world problems. Thanks, you got here faster than I expected. <laughs> Nice to meet you. Thank you. I'll get that one on. Alleyways. <laughs> Alleyways travel, that's it. All right, have a good day, man. Today's vlog is about reality. It's about what you do when you're stuck at home. It's about getting a job and making money so you can take that next adventure. This is my sister. She's making an appearance in the vlog today. Oh. Appearance oh made. <laughs> Chrissy, hey. Hi. Hey, you're in the vlog too. I'm in the vlog too. Yeah. Yeah, I'll give you a kiss. Come on. All right. Yeah. Thanks for the coffee and the catch up. I'll see you soon. Yeah. I just got back from meeting my sister and one of my other mothers, Chrissy. Check this out. My sister got me a Harry Potter box set. Emily's gonna love that, especially. Thanks, Sarah. Don't get me wrong, I love home. The Gold Coast is easily the best city in Australia, in my opinion, and one of the best cities in the world. But, it is about chasing that feeling. Now, a lot of people wonder how you can travel, like how can you travel the world? Unless you're a full-time traveler, or you're a full-time digital nomad, there's really only one way you can do it. Get a job. You've got to be able to work hard, save your money, budget well, and then, go on your adventures. Because nothing in life is free and nothing in life is easy, no matter what anybody tells you. So work hard, put the work in, hustle hard, get life done, and then you can escape it for a different reality. I just did a whole lecture on how to get life done and do life right, and how you have to have everything together in order to be able to do what you want to do. And then I did the dumbest thing ever. <sighs> Left my keys upstairs, I can't scan back up or get into my house. So... Hey. Hey, I, um, I got back in. Someone was walking out of the lift as I walked in and I did leave the house open, so it's all good. Um, yeah, I literally just said he must have got in like two seconds ago. Alright, yeah, we'll take your time. I love you. I'll see you when you're back. We'll go shopping okay. for your bag. Okay, love you. Love you too. Bye. Bye. Two hours later. So here we are at Anaconda, getting Emily her new backpack. Shopping for a bag when you go backpacking is a really important thing. You have to think about uh, a lot like what you're going to be taking, how nomadic the lifestyle is you're going to be living, how long you are away, but mostly how comfortable it is. A lot of the weight needs to go to the hips, shouldn't be uh, you know, too low over the shoulders or, or pulling any weight down on your back. But you can always ask a professional at one of these places to help you out. And, uh, and I recommend not bringing your wife shopping unless you want to spend nine hours choosing a bag. <laughs> so 
the moral of the vlog is always prepare for travel, always be planning your next adventure, and don't take home for granted. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and subscribe.